2020, Opero was challenged by Finnish to conceptualize a low-cost latrine that could provide a sanitation solution for a majority of households in rural Kenya. This is because majority of Kenyan households use traditional pit latrines. Often, these solutions are expensive to construct and require regular emptying. When these pit latrines fill up, they are either abandoned or require servicing, and this operational management presents a challenging sanitation problem for most households. Our solution, the Vetiva latrine, replaces the need to have a pit. It uses the Vetiva plant's potential to remediate water, allowing for safe containment and treatment of waste water from the toilet. The Vetiva latrine has three salient innovative features. A sato pump, that is a pan that has a mechanical seal that closes off preventing transmission of insects or gases, a two-barrel septic system that eliminates the need for a septic tank by allowing solids to settle at the bottom where the microorganisms decompose them, and the leachate flows to the vetiva bed that is planted with vetiva grass that polishes the effluent eliminating the need for further treatment. Users have reported a high level of usability of the Vetiva latrine in rural settings. No order, maintenance and excreta handling issues have been recorded when using the system. It's cheap compared to other latrines like a pit latrine maybe whereby you start there by digging a hole, you construct it up to finishing. I think this one is cheap. Yes, it's so much easier. Compared to other toilets, because uh, we flush, not the first thing. And um, secondly, uh, cleaning it, it's very easy, it takes a very short period of time to clean it. Is it smelly? No, it doesn't uh, smell. You can even eat inside the toilet. Because uh, I think they, they, they did. Uh, 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 below, below that, that blue sort of pan is, is helping to control that, that, that smell. Do you find the, it better than the normal pit latrine? Yeah, this one is better than uh, pit latrine because uh, if I try to compare pit latrine, uh, sometimes you have to, uh, when it, it gets filled, maybe you, 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 you construct a new one or <coughs> you call the exhaust a drain, but this one, you, you, uh, the, uh, there are two drums whereby we empty, which is which is giving a very easy work. Okay, but have you had to empty it? Yeah, we were we've done many times. At times it uh, it, 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 it it does like a um, what is it called? Like in a jar, but we, we open it empty. The water is okay for the bowl. How long does it take, like, to empty? To empty. Yeah. Thirty minutes, is enough. Because there, it's only small uh, septic tanks, only two. So to empty, it, 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 it takes a very short period of time. This solution is a very efficient and low-cost method to safely manage and treat household waste. Once fully propagated, vetiva has a nutritive value similar to that of napier grass, which makes it suitable as an animal feed, making it ideal for rural settings in the Kenyan market.